Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to make a chicken salad. You could substitute the chicken for tuna fish or cheese if you wish. It all tastes nice. So let's begin. Start off with the lettuce. About two leaves of iceberg lettuce is enough for about two people. If you're really hungry, make it three, but two should be enough. Chop this up into very fine pieces, as small as you can make it, as shown. When they're all prepared, put them in the colander. With the radishes, top and tail them, and chop them into very small pieces. And again, when they're completed, put them in the colander. And finally, we have the uh, cucumber. Chop into small pieces again, and put the whole lot into the colander and give them a good swirl under the tap, nice cold water. And when that's done, we put the whole lot into a spinner. Use a centrifugal force to spin the water, moisture off the salad leaves and the, the radishes and what have you. A simple device but very effective of removing moisture from the salad. As you can see from the bottom of the pan now there's water in the bottom which has been drained off. So there we are, put the salad back into the colander ready for the next process. So we'll start with the chicken now. The chicken again to be cut up into very small pieces just like the salad, very similar size pieces. Just keep chopping away finished chopping up the chicken, add it to the mix and mix thoroughly. Next we add the sweet corn, probably green giant is the best and that's enough for two people half a tin. So mix thoroughly before adding the salt and pepper to your taste. The final ingredient is the Hellman's mayonnaise. Just a small couple of squirts, enough to coat the salad. Mix thoroughly and it's ready to eat. That's enough for one person, but you could have a whole lot if you want. I personally find it very easy to eat with a spoon rather than knife and fork, but that's your choice. Enjoy it. Bon appetit. Mm -hmm.